Good morning, travel day. Gary's just outside with the cases. We've just had a quick rush around. Alarm went off about four o'clock, we're a bit jaded, but uh, yeah, woke up to a jet. So Gary says you don't normally get that view out your window. We're going down now to grab our taxi. To the taxi with our couple of suitcases. <laughs> when else has got like just one bag or whatever, we've got like four. I'm, I'm like no makeup and a bit. Uh, so we've just went for the taxi, which we've rushed downstairs for. We're told to be here five minutes early. It's not even here. So I'm hoping it's going to come. Or that could be interesting. Terminal three. Virgin Atlantic is A. So there we go. Very nice taxi driver. Let's go and check in. So, funny story, went through security, took everything out, the iPad and the Kindle and that kind of thing, and um, it was quite funny because we, we were more concerned about Gary's medication, his sprays and things he has to have, saying we need to take them out, and, um, and then one of the bags got dragged off through security and we got pulled to one side. We didn't realise until the last minute that as we left the hotel, we'd got a couple of bottles of water and the we sort of rushed downstairs a bit quick, didn't we? Yeah. Threw we them in the bag. Yeah. We didn't have enough hands to manoeuvre that shipment of cases. Yeah, so, so we... Couldn't we, hold them all, so I threw them in the bag. Get threw them in the bag, thinking we'll take them out when we get there. Completely forgot about them. And um, so yeah, that was what, that's what it was, the water. I was like, oh my God, I'm so sorry. We've got everything else out and panicked about everything else. And uh, so we've had some breakfast. We went to Cafe Nero, or Cafe Nerd, as our daughter used to call it when she was little. <laughs> it does look like a day. It does, it does. Um, yeah, so we've, we've done that. Gary's had his oats this morning. That one's red. Probably speaking. Yeah. Um, yeah, so we're just waiting for our boarding gate and um, then we'll be getting on board. Still doesn't quite feel real. It's a 3.30 actually, I think yesterday I might have said it was a... Um, yes, it's A330. I might have said 3 it's A330, 300, I believe. So... I was trying to remember, like, 30, 30 and 50 are twin engines and the 40 is four engines. Anyway... Yeah, it still doesn't quite feel like we're here, does it? No. So, um, yeah. So we've just got our gate number, we're gate 19, and it's a 20 minute walk. Gate 19 is 20 minutes walk. So this is such a big airport, we, we, we much prefer Gatwick, we have to say, don't we? But this is so big, and um, 20 minutes. So I think we'll be getting our steps in. So yeah, gate 19, there we go. Gary's just had a bit, little bit of a moment. Just gone a bit mad on the travelator. Such a good sound though. It's going really fast, making it go funny. Yeah. 
after electronic devices should now be turned on for sense of flight mode. It's, we can speak to a member of our cabin crew as they check that our cabin is ready for departure. Thank you for your attention and once again.
scary having a look out the window. What a clear day, a clear view. I 
wasn't being rude. Well, there you go. So I'm going to settle back and see if I can find a film to watch. Or Scary settles back and takes his shoes off. Look at that leg room. I wasn't going to drink, but I thought I might as well. Um, I might not have it, I don't know. We've got some, um, some Moroccan hummus with um, some quinoa. For dessert, that's a lemon posset. And for dinner, we've got some breaded chicken with um, crushed potatoes and vegetables of some sort and some sort of garlic. All looks very nice, and obviously, you get your little airplane salt and peppers, which always say on the bottom something like the property of, um, or I stole this from Virgin Atlantic or something like that, but I can't see because I've got my glasses on. <laughs> yeah, Gary's got exactly the same, haven't you? Virgin Atlantic. Pinch from Virgin Atlantic. Nice, nice, sir. Well, that food was very, very nice, wasn't it? Yeah. We kind of shared because we forgot to ask for a low fat milk for Gary.
Warhunter, with the local time is just approaching 2 p.m. For your information, we are arriving 15 minutes ahead of our scheduled arriving time. We would ask you to please keep your seatbelt fastened until our captain has turned off the fastened seatbelt signs. We'll return any items that we've stowed for you as soon as we arrive at the terminal. Today we're arriving at the main terminal, Orlando International Airport. Before you leave us, remember to check around your seat and in the seat pocket to make sure you've got everything with you. And when opening your head lockers, be careful of items that may have moved during our landing. <coughs> if you'd like to donate any loose change or foreign currency to our passport to change appeal, there'll be a large collection bag available as you exit the aircraft today. Stops. Please exit and follow the signs to baggage lane. What is? So we're here. We've arrived. What a journey. Yeah, lovely. Quite interesting. We'll catch up with you later and tell you all about it. Noticed a bit of a heat difference. I'm really hot. Yeah, we've still got this fleece on, haven't we? I don't know how. It's so hot. Yeah, so we've got our bags and we're now going to go off to get the car. And, um, We'll catch up with you later and tell you what's been going on. I mean, the staff, I can't praise them highly enough on Virgin. Absolutely fantastic weather. Yeah, well, Absolutely good. amazing. So, um, yeah, catch you soon. Yeah. hot hot so we've got our car um, it's been a bit of a palaver trying to get it and we're so hot but anyway this is our car I will show you very quickly so we have a Ford Explorer 
and the lady has said that they don't come with any sat navs in them which is a bit strange because we've always had them with built-in sat navs as they're usually like newer cars oh no number plate do they normally have a number plate at the front no. i can't remember no oh no they don't do they i remember now oh look little lights on the door don't know what they are they're numbers hmm. yeah so this is our ford explorer now we have a florida plate but it looks like it has actually got some kind of sat nav in it so i don't know because she said it didn't but there is a screen there so i'll have to see what do you think gary yeah it's really nice yeah so let's go let's get back to our apartment and uh, chill out so we seem to have hit the friday night rush hour a bit like at home solid traffic's been solid for a while so uh just like the M25. <laughs> and it is so hot. And there we go, we're gonna sit in all this for a bit. So we're all checked in and they've just been really good and given us the room we wanted on the ground floor in the building we want. They're always fantastic here, we love it here. And Gabby's just seen this thing for a sealed bid auction for um, a Stanley um, Marvel kind of compilation. I'll put the picture in. in the right. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's really good, but I don't know if we can stretch to that at the moment. It's so hot. So I think what we're going to do now is go to the room, drop everything off, and maybe just have a drink or something before we go to Walmart. So uh, we'll see you in the room. Mm -hmm.